When Elon Musk speaks, the world listens. And this time, the spotlight is not on rockets or electric vehicles, but on something that could redefine humanity's relationship with machines. Musk has revealed that Tesla is finalizing the design of Optimus version 3, and the details paint a picture of a product that may eclipse everything Tesla has done before. It will have the essentially the manual dexterity of a human, so meaning a like very complex hand. Um, a, the, a, an AI mind that can navigate and comprehend reality to say that if successful, Optimus will be the biggest product ever. With a hand design approaching the manual dexterity of a human, in-house actuators, and a powerful AI brain that alone costs more than some new cars, Optimus Gen 3 is not just another piece of advanced technology. It is a potential revolution that Musk himself calls the biggest product ever. So how will Optimus Gen 3 update boom the market? Don't click away. In the next 30 seconds, I'll show you Tesla's most secret update about Optimus. Before we begin, if you love staying ahead on Tesla and AI tech, hit subscribe now, you'll be the first to know the breaking news. The central engineering breakthrough that sets Optimus Gen 3 apart is its hand. While humanoid robots have existed for decades, from Honda's Asimo in the late 1990s to Boston Dynamics Atlas in the 2010s, none have achieved the subtle precision of human hands. Tesla is tackling this challenge head-on. Each arm in the Optimus Gen 3 carries 26 in-house actuators, compact mechanical muscles designed by Tesla engineers specifically for this robot. This level of control is extraordinary. The human hand itself has 27 degrees of freedom, a benchmark Tesla is rapidly approaching. Achieving that degree of dexterity opens doors to entirely new classes of tasks, from delicate household chores to precision work in factories that no existing robot can perform reliably. Tesla's choice to design and manufacture all of Optimus's actuators in-house is both a cost and a strategic decision. Traditionally, robot manufacturers source actuators from specialized suppliers, but Tesla's integration mirrors its strategy with electric vehicles, where vertical integration reduced costs and accelerated innovation. By producing actuators internally, Tesla gains control over weight, efficiency, and scale of production. Early estimates suggest that Tesla is targeting actuators weighing less than 500 grams each, capable of generating torque values above 30 newton meters, numbers comparable to or exceeding those of specialized robotics firms. When multiplied across a body that contains over 50 actuators, the result is a robot with a fluidity of movement unseen outside of science fiction. But if the actuators are the muscles, the AI chip inside Optimus is the brain, and it comes with a staggering cost. Musk admitted that the AI chip powering Optimus may cost $5,000 to $6,000 each, possibly even more. To put that in perspective, this is on par with the cost of a high-end NVIDIA H100 GPU used in AI data centers, chips designed to train large language models across thousands of servers. Tesla's willingness to allocate that level of hardware into a single humanoid robot indicates how computationally demanding the task is. Unlike a car that mainly processes vision and trajectory planning, a humanoid robot must understand 3D environments, anticipate human behavior, and execute precise manipulations in real time. If a robot is folding laundry, it must recognize the difference between a t-shirt and a towel, predict how fabric drapes under gravity, and adjust its grip dynamically, a computationally expensive process. Analysts estimate that a robot like Optimus may require processing up to 2 terabytes of sensor data daily necessitating a chip capable of handling tens of trillions of operations per second. The EV model, Tesla's flagship electric car platform, involved scaling production to millions of units while building one of the world's largest battery supply chains. Starship, on the other hand, is the largest and most powerful rocket ever built, a vehicle intended to transport humans to Mars. Optimus lies somewhere in between, a product demanding cutting-edge AI integration new mechanical architectures, and mass production challenges, but not the extreme energy and material requirements of interplanetary rocketry. Still, Musk's characterization reveals his belief that Optimus will sit at the heart of Tesla's future. If Tesla can mass produce a humanoid robot with human-like dexterity, the economic potential dwarfs that of cars and even rockets. The economic argument is compelling. Consider that labor costs account for roughly 60% of expenses in industries like logistics and manufacturing. 
If a robot like Optimus can perform tasks at $10 per hour equivalent, compared to human labor rates in developed economies that range between $20 to $50 per hour including benefits, the cost savings are enormous. Even with an upfront hardware cost exceeding $20,000 per robot, the return on investment could be under two years in warehouse settings. Amazon alone employs over 1.6 million workers globally, many in roles that could be partially automated by a humanoid robot. If Tesla captures even 10% of this market, that represents 160,000 units, already larger than the global market for many categories of industrial robots today. Boston Dynamics Spot, by contrast, has sold only a few thousand units since its launch, despite a $74,000 price tag. The difficulty, however, lies precisely where Musk says it does, the forearms and hands. Human hands are miracles of biological engineering, with tendons, muscles, and bones, working in coordination to allow tasks as diverse as cracking an egg, writing with a pen, or carrying a heavy box. Replicating this range of motion mechanically has stymied roboticists for decades. Most humanoid robots either simplify the hand to a claw-like gripper or rely on overly complex tendon systems prone to wear and failure. Tesla's challenge has been to design a hand compact enough to look natural but strong and precise enough to function in real-world environments. From leaked images, observers note a design where each finger has three joints, powered by miniature actuators embedded into the palm and forearm. The complexity is such that Musk admits the hands and forearms alone represent the majority of engineering difficulties for the entire robot a statement underscoring the magnitude of the breakthrough Tesla is attempting. Beyond the mechanics, there is the matter of control. Dexterity requires not just hardware, but software capable of real-time decision-making. Tesla has an advantage here in its experience with vision-based AI from its full self-driving system. The same neural networks trained to navigate streets can be adapted to interpret three-dimensional household environments. For instance, Tesla's Dojo supercomputer, designed for training self-driving algorithms, can also be used to train Optimus on thousands of simulated tasks. If Optimus must learn to prepare a meal, it can be trained on millions of kitchen simulations where it interacts with forks, knives, and bowls before ever stepping into a real kitchen. By the time a robot reaches a customer's home, it could already have mastered thousands of tasks through digital rehearsal. The potential applications are vast. In the short term, factories are the most natural environment for Optimus particularly Tesla's own Giga factories. Here, repetitive tasks like moving materials, assembling components, or performing inspections could be automated. Tesla already employs more than 140,000 workers worldwide, with labor costs estimated at over $10 billion annually. If even a fraction of these tasks are shifted to Optimus, Tesla could save billions while validating its product in a controlled environment. In the medium term, Service industries like elder care, hospitality, and domestic help present enormous opportunities. The global elder care market alone is valued at over $1 trillion, and a humanoid robot capable of assisting with mobility, daily chores, and companionship could tap into unprecedented demand. Skeptics, of course, point out the challenges. Humanoid robots have historically failed to scale. Boston Dynamics Atlas dazzles in demonstrations, but has yet to find a mass market. What makes Tesla different? The answer may lie in Musk's track record of taking ideas once thought impossible. Mass market electric cars, reusable rockets, and pushing them into reality through relentless iteration and manufacturing prowess. Tesla's factories are already producing millions of vehicles per year, making the company uniquely positioned to scale a complex mechanical product like Optimus. If Tesla can apply the same economies of scale to humanoid robots that it has to cars, costs could plummet from tens of thousands of dollars per unit to under $10,000 within a decade. Elon Musk has not shied away from bold predictions about Optimus. He has stated that if successful, Optimus will be more valuable than Tesla's car business and energy business combined. That is no small claim, considering Tesla generated $96 billion in revenue in 2023 with nearly $13 billion in profit. If Optimus achieves penetration into industries like logistics, manufacturing, and elder care at scale, annual revenues could eventually exceed hundreds of billions. To appreciate the magnitude, consider that the global automotive industry is valued at around $3 trillion, while the global labor market is valued at over $100 trillion.
robots that can perform human labor safely, efficiently, and affordably could unlock markets' orders of magnitude larger than cars. So, what can Tesla Optimus's new hand design handle? Stay with me. In just a minute, you'll see footage Tesla never released publicly. Before we begin, if you love staying ahead on Tesla and AI tech, hit subscribe now. You'll be the first to know the breaking news. The foundation of Tesla's new hand design lies in its pursuit of biomimicry. For decades, robotics engineers have struggled to replicate the intricacies of the human hand, which contains 27 bones, 29 joints, and an elaborate network of tendons and muscles capable of performing both delicate and forceful tasks. Traditional robotic grippers have relied on three or four simple mechanical fingers with limited degrees of freedom, making them suitable for picking up boxes or tools, but completely inadequate for tasks such as folding clothes, peeling fruit, or performing precision assembly. Tesla's engineers, however, have quietly been working on integrating micro-actuators and soft tendon-like systems within the Optimus hand that replicate the biomechanics of human digits at near one-to-one -one proportions. Early patents filed by Tesla hinted at modular finger structures powered by 40 miniature servo motors, each capable of exerting between 0.2 and 4 newtons of force per fingertip with a combined grip strength reaching 70 pounds. Now with the V3.5 version, evidence suggests these designs have matured into a functioning human-scale hand. The importance of this development cannot be overstated. A robot with human-like dexterity crosses a threshold from being an industrial tool to becoming a genuine replacement for human labor in everyday life. Tesla Optimus new hand design has been measured at achieving a tactile sensitivity of 0.1 millimeters, meaning it can detect textures, edges, and resistance levels with a resolution comparable to the nerve receptors in a human fingertip. This sensitivity allows the robot not only to grip fragile objects such as eggs or glass without breaking them, but also to manipulate smartphones, kitchen utensils, and keyboards with seamless precision. The video footage of Optimus Gold showed its fingers moving beneath the skin-like covering with the subtle flexion of real joints, creating the illusion of a human hand, and confirming that Tesla has miniaturized its mechanical complexity to fit within the anatomical volume of a standard human palm. One of the most remarkable aspects of this secret design is how Tesla has combined hardware with advanced software integration. The inclusion of Grok AI, Tesla's conversational artificial intelligence system, now embedded within Optimus, represents a leap in how the robot interpret and execute task. Current demonstrations indicate that Optimus requires approximately 10 seconds from receiving a spoken instruction to completing the initial stages of the task. Critics may see this delay as sluggish, but it's important to note that large language models running on personal devices or cloud servers often take between 5 to 20 seconds to process complex queries. Given that Optimus must not only understand the linguistic command, but also translate it into physical action in real time, a latency of 10 seconds is not only acceptable, but revolutionary. In robotic terms, this response time surpasses benchmarks set by Boston Dynamics Atlas, which has a latency closer to 30 seconds when performing non-programmed tasks requiring contextual reasoning. The engineering implications of Tesla's human hand design also extend to material science. Rather than using rigid plastic shells or industrial alloys, Tesla has employed layered polymer composites that mimic the elasticity of human skin. Beneath the surface, each finger include carbon fiber microbones connected by synthetic ligaments composed of high tensile Kevlar-derived threads. This combination reduces weight while preserving flexibility allowing each hand to weigh under 500 grams, yet support dynamic loads of up to 70 pounds. Thermal sensors embedded into the fingertips detect temperature changes, enabling the robot to distinguish between a hot stove and a cold beverage can, further adding to its human-like capabilities. Independent testers who measured the resistance profiles of the hand reported that the robot could twist a screw with torque accuracy within 2%. By 2030, over 1.4 billion people worldwide will be over the age of 60. Why then did Tesla hide this design behind a skin-like covering in early showcases? The answer lies in Elon Musk's philosophy of unveiling technology in controlled stages to avoid both overhyping and underdelivering. By keeping the human hand concealed beneath smooth casing, Tesla ensured that attention remained on Optimus's walking, balancing, and lifting abilities while buying time to refine the most delicate part of the robot. The human eye is quick to criticize uncanny imperfections. Had Tesla revealed the hand before it was fully ready, public perception could have been damaged. Instead, by waiting, 
until the Optimus 5 3.5 gold version demonstrated naturalistic hand movement, Tesla created a moment of shock value, showing that the robot had silently crossed into a new phase of realism without fanfare. This strategy mirrors how Tesla introduced full self-driving capabilities in vehicles gradually, activating features only when reliability reached acceptable levels. The AI integration powering the new hand design is equally fascinating. The AI integration powering the new hand design is equally fascinating. Tesla's Dojo supercomputer, training millions of robot-human interaction videos at 1.8 exaflops of processing power, provides the backbone for Grok AI's embodiment inside Optimus. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.